Oh yes! Get the shades out. What's up guys? My name is Trevor. Welcome back to the Dr. Vet YouTube channel. And today, we're going to be talking, dealing with Miss Dora here. So, just roll that intro. As you guys know, I've been struggling with the battery on Miss Dora. So we have a new parking spot right next to our battery tender. And so far so good, she's been keeping it. Our tender black, uh, de black and decker over there has been keeping us charged and ready to roll in any time we need, just like this. Fires right up. Love it, love it, love it, love it. However, I just can't um, quite figure out why it has to constantly charge. I mean, it's not like I'm driving a minute, turning it off, letting it sit for days, and then driving a minute, letting it sit for days. Like, we actually drive a few miles every day, more than a few. So, I just, it doesn't make sense to me. So, right now, we're gonna load up. We're gonna go to AutoZone uh, or O'Reilly's, one of the parts stores here in town. Somebody mentioned that I should go, I believe it was Chevelle, so shout out Chevelle. Said to go to O'Reilly's on 30th, which her mom is the manager of, and we will, well, we'll go there. And we'll get it checked out. Check out that battery, see if it's uh, good or bad, and we'll, hmm. If it's bad, we'll come up with a plan to get a new one. Maybe they got like sponsor videos or something. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, we'll figure it out. We'll take you guys along. Enjoy the ride. Enjoy the show. Let's go. All right, here we go. O'Reilly's. Hashtag not sponsored. But let's see about getting this battery tested. Yee -yee. Bad battery. It is. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I thought so. I've been charging it for three days. Alright guys, so you heard uh, the guy at O'Reilly's yesterday. He said the battery is bad, we tested it, it's bad. And I had to order a battery. So that means today we've got to take this battery out and get ready for the new one. So we can get our cord charged, you know how that all works out. So, I am going to be taking it out, and yes, it is raining today. So we'll be taking this out in the rain, no big chicken wing. We can get her done, it's not, not a big deal. You can hear my rooster crowing in the background. Not really my rooster, but he's her rooster.
And there we have it. The battery is free. And now we should be able to just lift this puppy out. Scooch the T over. Set her down. So that is how remove we remove a battery, replace a battery in a 2016 Ford Explorer. And well, um, as you can tell, that looks to be the factory motor uh, battery. To me, that looks like it. Um, we could probably find a date on here. I'm sure this got a date somewhere. Figure out when it was manufactured. Nonetheless, if that is the original battery that came with the Explorer when she was made, Miss Dora here, that's a darn good battery because it's lasted 95,000 miles and well it is 2022 so that is a good six years life of, on a battery it's not it's, it's probably about average actually except oh look right there nope this is not it is not there it is eight of 18. So this battery is from 2018. So <laughs> that's not the original battery. That's two years after um, getting uh, uh, the, the, the doors 2016. This is what I'm trying to say. Doors 2016. That is two years after. So this is not the original battery. So the original battery must have crapped out, and then they replaced it with this. An OEM one and here we are we're gonna replace it with something much better so stay tuned we will get that picked up and I'll show you guys how to install it when I get it and get it installed and uh, we'll be good to go for the next 24 years <laughs> seriously though the next battery lasts a lot longer than this one because this one only lasted four years man this door is going to be happy now. Got one of them Optimum batteries. These things, I, I swear by those things. I had one when I had my old blue pickup, old blue. And that thing lasted me for eight years. It's actually, it's as far as I know, it is still in the Corvette right now. So that's like a 10 year life battery right there. Like amazing. And for seven months of that battery's life, it was used to power a winch to drag the truck up into the shop and out of the shop and it never got charged once put it back in the truck when i was finished fired it right up <laughs> hey, yep there we go we got our old red top in here now and now is the moment of truth let's get those keys out give old dora a start here oh she won't restart that way there's probably something that's got to happen first. But hey, the horn worked. That's exciting news. Let's get in here. Oh yeah, old girl fires right up. Yee! Now we got to fix the radio. We got to restore all of our presets, reset the time. Oh brother, here we go. Oh hey, look at that. My hood is drawn. There's a door open. Huh, weird. So we're going to go into settings. Oh, how about that? Already updated the time. That's a cool feature because of uh, being connected to my phone, which is hard to get out of my pocket right now. But we can see that the time is correct, 8.15 p.m. And then we'll go in here and I guess turn on the radio and reset all of our presets. Reset all of our presets. That's kind of funny. So we got to go over here. Oh no, did they store? They did, they stored. Whew. That's a relief. Even though really we just use Bluetooth. But hey, anyways, um, if this video helped you guys out, definitely smash that thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe. 
We're on our way to 10,000 subscribers. I'm gonna find my keys down here while you guys click that button. And then, <clears throat> that's it for Miss Dora. She's good to go, again. Um, I still need to rotate her tires, which I plan to do soon. I do plan to rotate these. I'll just, that's something easy I can do at home, do myself, you know, put her up on jack stands, good to go. No more Ford battery. Off to, off to Optima batteries and a shout out to uh, Chevelle and Auto uh, O'Reilly's for getting me that battery quickly. I really appreciate that. Now we're back on the road again here with Dora and uh, well, I hope to see you guys out. So thank you so much. We appreciate you. Have a great night and God bless. I love these things. Highly, highly recommend.